This is going to be a very strange season for me this year, isn't it? I'm going to go to the commentary box without Paul for the first time since 1986. The fans are going to be looking at it very critically. Oh, he's not the same now that uh, Paul's left his side. It won't be the same. Well, alongside me now is Paul Sherwin, and he'll be joining me for the full three weeks as my co-commentator for the first time. To the summit, and he may not recognize his face, but if you've ever watched the Tour de France, you know his distinctive and famous voice. On the right, here comes Hondo. He's a walking, talking part of broadcast history. Well, you're known as the voice of the Tour de France. The voice of cycling. The legend, Phil Liggins. <laughs> Is there any stopping Lance Armstrong in this Tour de France? And the answer is no, there is not. Phil's never really had a chance to tell his side of that story. Well, Paul is already a British champion. He's three days old. Congratulations, Paul. And, and so it was the end of the dream. I really, really feel for Phil Liggett right now. How much longer will Phil Liggett continue? He's 75. I don't think Phil will ever be Phil without Paul. He can see the banner now. The moment is going to turn to a smile. He cannot believe it. He promised the Italians he'd do it. We're looking at the battle of Valterins here. It has never been like this before on the Tour de France. We didn't come here to believe that's what we were going to do, save Rhinos. We came here because we wanted to live here where Rhinos lived. But we've been drawn in now. Cycling has always been Phil's life. It's an impossible thing to intrude into. I was still training. A twister of the car every day from one hotel to the other, and I rode the bike to the West Mountains. And, uh, and I was too tired to do anything else at night, so we got on very well. Thank you. Lovely. Thank you. We love it. We love it. So melodious. Across the wheels. A global legend for cycling. Just this dulcet tone, the sound of familiarity. It's worth just watching every bike race just for Phil. Phil will have a different show now without Paul. The tour goes on. <laughs>